Hi guys, Western Whips here. Today I'm going to be showing you guys four basic whip cracks. And the whip I'm using is my five foot nylon whip. So yeah, let's get started. The first whip crack you're going to want to learn when you first bring out your whip is the cattleman's crack. So all you're going to do is swing it around with your right hand. If you're left handed, obviously it'll be with your left hand. But just swing it around with your right hand and then bring it forward when it's fully outstretched behind you. It's got to be fully outstretched behind you before you curl it forward. If it's not, and it's pointing like up there behind your head, diagonal, when you bring it forward, you can whip yourself. So always make sure it's fully behind you, fully outstretched behind you before you curl it forward. And just swing your arm down. Just like that. And from the cattleman's, you can go to the reverse cattleman's, which is just the cattleman's, only backwards. So instead of waiting for it to be behind you before you bring it forward, you're gonna wait for it to be in front of you before you bring it behind you. Just like that. And again, you're swinging your arm down. And you're curling it that way. See? And from the reverse, Cattleman's, you can go to the overhead, which is all you're going to do is you're going to swing it towards your left shoulder, just like that. And then when the whip is um, behind your left shoulder, you're going to change direction. Just like that, look. Yeah, just like that. You're going to change direction and curl it that way. And then from the overhead crack, you can go to the reverse overhead, which instead of going this way, I'll go this way. And just like the overhead, you're gonna curl it in that direction. No, in that direction, just like that. Just like that, and you're gonna change direction when Instead of behind your left shoulder, it's going to be in front of your left shoulder. You're going to do sort of like a half circle. And yeah, those are the four basic whip cracks. And if you learn those, you can easily do some really slow combos, just like a cattleman's, reverse cattleman's. Look, cattleman's and reverse cattleman's, that's called a slow figure eight. And that's really easy. Or you could change from vertical to horizontal. Like you could go from a cattleman's to reverse overhead, just like that. Or from a reverse cattleman's to an overhead, just like that. You can keep on going. And you can easily do that really simple combo if you just learn these four whip cracks. Cattleman's. Reverse cattleman, overhead, reverse overhead. Just learn those four and you can do some really nice looking combos. And once you've mastered those com that those easy combos, you can do something a little more fast. Like there's there's this one crack called the fast figure eight, which is just a figure eight, a slow figure eight only faster. And then after you learn that one, you can do this whip combo called the volley, and you're just gonna go like this. It's like, sorry, it's like a, it's like, like two or more um fast figure eights. Just like that. Yeah, and those are the four basic whip cracks. And hope you guys enjoyed watching and join me for my next video, which I'll probably teach you guys how to do probably like a fast figure eight or something. So thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye.